While it's unclear what will happen to the families who are already separated, experts say the damage being done to these children is severe. And reporter Sean Franklin has more on what could easily be some long-term consequences on their health as well as their well-being. Sean? Beth, Brandon, a traumatic event like being separated from a parent severely affects a child. And I spoke to an expert who says the harm they experience can be just as bad as child abuse. Totally feeling lost. I mean, that's, I can't imagine. It's real for nearly 2,300 children at the Mexico-U.S. border. Losing the um, only, like, attachment figure that they've ever known. They're separated from their parents because their family tried to cross the border illegally. Licensed clinical psychologist Dr. Katherine Perkle says time without a stable caregiver is one of the worst situations a child can face. When a child is sort of exposed to a traumatic situation like this, that there can be a dysregulation in the emotional processing centers. She says your fight or flight response can go into hyperdrive. And it can stay there and it can sort of affect the way that you process danger in the world you know, for the rest of your life. She says those changes, especially for children 12 and under, affect how you make decisions later in life. Even as a, as a rational adult that can know that some of the beliefs you have are irrational, right? There's still like a emotional part of you that connects with some of those like irrational or less helpful beliefs. Which for these kids could be a reality. Even if the, you know, you get reunited a day, a week later, I think forever, the reality that that could happen is now there. Perkle says we can't spare the children that have already gone through this, but she says she's hopeful with the executive order that future children can avoid the situation. Beth.